and welcome to Hurt TV's 24-hour digital Halloween live stream. It looks like our first guest has arrived. It's the Luxie. What's the matter, Luxie? I thought it was your favorite time of year. What happened to the Halloween spirit? It's gonna be okay, buddy. We can find the Halloween spirit together. Who could that be? Just in time! We have a big problem. What is it? Oh, I know, we forgot our Halloween costumes. Uh, oops, let's try that again. You guys look great, but that's not the problem. Not the Halloween spirit. I think all the stress from this year made it disappear. It's our duty to bring it back. It's a big responsibility. How are we gonna do that? I have an idea. What is it, Chelsea? Halloween treats! Mm. Food makes everything better. Mm, that's a great idea. I'll get bacon! What? I can bake? James, I think we're gonna need a little outside help. Step back. Whoa. Baby shark, do, 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 baby shark, do, do. From Chelsea to Brie. <laughs> Dear Brie, the Halloween spirit is missing. Luxie needs your help. She's thinking of like big cupcakes and. Oh. I'm gonna need backup. Hey, Blaine. Hey, Bree. Yeah, okay, so I just got a note from Chelsea. She said that they think the Halloween spirit is missing. Yeah, and the look she needs her help. She thinks if we bake cupcakes, that we can bring the Halloween spirit back. You're in luck, because not only am I a champion in the ring, but I am also a champion in cupcake mastery. This is gonna be easy. Betty Crocker wish she could. Okay, I know you think you're good, but I'm actually the master. <laughs> Before we get down to the fun stuff though, Crypt TV is partnering with an amazing charity organization called Pencils of Promise. What they do is they build safe schools and provide healthcare programs for students all over the world. For $75, you can sponsor a student for an entire year. But please, just donate whatever you can. To make things interesting, I'm going to beat you with my gloves on the entire time. You're on. Let's go. I bet. So, literally me and Blaine are baking a bake-off and I'm gonna win. I don't know about him, but I am the master of making cupcakes. He thinks he's the master, but... So I just set my oven at 350 degrees Fahrenheit. I have this glass bowl in my hand. I'm ready to start mixing. Gloves are staying on. I'm a man of my word. Wait, how many? It doesn't say how much. Doing it by the eye. So I'm just pouring this in here. It's a lot. Yeah, I mean, that's enough. All right, let's get a little of this. Make sure it's all out. You probably didn't make sure it was all out. You gotta make sure. Instead of proportioning here for nothing, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Now one cup of water. That's some high quality H2O. About a third of that went on the floor. So, my secret is you put warm water. You put half cup of hot water and half cup of cold water because, I don't know why. Now for the vegetable oil. I don't want to spill this. 
I'm gonna use the power of my mind. Half cup of baby oil. I did not measure this. This is my trick too. Half cup, and then you just, just you know what I'm saying? Now for the eggs. <laughs> this is <laughs> this is gonna be hard. It's gonna be hard. But I know there's gonna be a lot of haters out there saying that I didn't try with my outfit. You know what? I love Karate Kid. I love boxing. Best of both worlds, Karate Kickboxer. Three eggs. Three eggs. Let's crack these. Oh, baby's in there. Put this in here. This way. All right. I'm pretty sure Blaine looks way worse doing this than I do because I'm the master. Egg number one of three. Now we're gonna stir it. We're gonna try to at least. Just fine. All right, I'm thinking. Let's do it. No, let's do green. Because green is weird. Green, you wouldn't expect green. This smells like strawberries. Yes, it is strawberry flavor. And I'm gonna do green because of World Two or World Three, I think. World Three is like nothing full of. It's just plants and it looks like a jungle. So this is for world three. Two. World two. This is for world two. I did the whole thing and I still get confused with the world. So if you get confused with the world, don't even trip. It's not just you. Dude, how long does this take? I thought this would already be getting thick. I'm gonna put a little more green because I'm just dramatic. Oh, this smells so good. This reminds me of the summertime. To be honest, I wanted to put some red in there, but then it was going to look like Christmas. So, I won't. And also from experience, if you put too much food coloring in your stuff, it kind of tastes like that. I can't say. We made a little mess, and we're going to kind of clean this up. I don't know if real bakers do like this but I'm a real baker and I do, so. Cute, it's cute, she's cute. And this green cupcake life is just serving all the looks. I think we're pretty good. And we're ready to go into the oven. Yes, everyone, I am a white belt. I'm currently working on that to uh, go to the next stage. Dedication, you know. But I still wouldn't mess with me. I still wouldn't mess with me. If I can, if I can make cupcakes with gloves on. Just kidding, I'm a lover, not a fighter. Don't forget to vote. Vote. We're gonna bake this for, I'd say like 15, 20 minutes, but we're gonna check. I also, while it's baking, kinda just wanna throw 
want to throw you guys for a loop because I'm kind of thinking that I'm going to bake some cookies so that I can decorate. Yeah, come on. A little batter paste pack. Woo! So I was thinking baking cookies. Mm. Oh. Yeah, we're going to bake cookies so that we can kind of make the stereoscope a little um, emblem because I have to decorate these cupcakes and we only have 10 minutes to decorate and me and Blaine are going up against each other. So it's Team Brie. Team Brie all zeit And there they are in all their beauty. I had to take my gloves off for safety reasons. Hope you understand. All right. Oh, let these bad boys simmer for about 30 minutes. Let's see. Fresh out of the oven. Now let's get decorating. I'm gonna use my fingers because you make food with love when you use your fingers. And you're just gonna roll this out. It's a roll, but I'm not. You pat it out. Right. Good. Oh, sorry. Put this in the oven. Okay, so I think they're ready. Let's see. Ooh, come, come, come. Look at this goodness. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's get them out. And we gotta let them cool. We gotta let them cool. <laughs> Down here, I'm up here. I got a cookie going. I'm gonna cut out some circles. It's a surprise. They look gorgeous. Look at this green stuff. It's just so cute. We're gonna let them cool for maybe like, I don't know, um, 10, 15 minutes and then we're gonna decorate. But right now we're gonna cut out the little cookie cutter things so that I can decorate myself. Okay, so now the cupcakes are done, and we put them in the fridge just a little bit so that they can cool. And I'm going to decorate, so let's see. And I guess Wayne has the memo on frosting on cupcakes, so I'm only going to do half of mine with cupcakes. I mean, with frosting, I think. So I am going to color this little cookie, mm. black, almost like a wheel, you know, but not quite a wheel. Okay, so this is good. And let's put some grass. This is grass. Wow, that's a lot of grass. Okay, whatever. Get the glass, the grass. Oh, it's a little messier than I thought. Oh my God, it's getting on the floor. Okay, and then get these sprinkles and we're gonna Okay. Well, that worked. Okay. So this is a wheel. This is a stereoscope. And I'm going to write a triangle. Because it's a strong shape. Then you just stick it up because that's what they do in baking shows. Clearly. That looks so cute. Oh my god. Okay, so this is one. This is one. It goes at the top because I'm so proud of it. And we got 12 more of these babies. So I think I'm going to cover this one with some red. Let's see. What should I color? What should I do? Um, ooh, maybe. 
Maybe let's color this whole thing in red. Okay. I feel like this is what Blaine did and these look so terrible like this. Spread it around town. Right! Looking good. I don't know what this is, but you know. We're gonna use these. I don't know what these are for either. Oh my god, I have a good idea. Okay, this is gonna say world, world. <sighs> I think this is the one. World one. Cute. And then, see that? There you go. That's the second one. World. Oh my god, and then I'm gonna make a cupcake for myself. And I'm gonna spell my name. It's gonna say Callie. World three. Ooh, so cute. Oh my god. Okay, I'm so happy. World three. Then. Okay, so I'm all done. I decorated all my cupcakes, and I think I did pretty good. I think I won, to be honest. We got the World 1 cupcake right here. We got a stereoscope with a triangle. It kind of melted. We got Callie, her name. I even put Drew, because you're going down. And yeah, got World 3 over here. You know, World 5 back here. And these little things are done. So I hope you guys enjoyed my little bake off and I will see you guys soon. Sarah the Rebel, Sarah the Rebel. Gremlins have taken over the stream. Gremlins? In this stream? Right now? All right, listen up, Gremlins. People may or may not have paid good money to watch this stream. And when people watch a stream, they come to chat with the homies, see some video game shenanigans, and not have monsters interrupt the stream. Am I gonna have to come up there and handle you myself? Do you think you puny little monsters can handle Sarah the Rebel? If I were you, I'd run that stream right now. Sorry, folks. <laughs> it won't happen again. What happened, Luxie? Yes, we did it! <sighs> Almost. We still have to fill up the rest of the bottle with Halloween spirit. I've got it. I'll do a real cool Halloween dance. Luxie, who's that on your pillow? Oh, where'd you get that? Oh, we should see if our friend Johnny has any ideas. Yeah, and in the meantime, I'll give you one of those pillows. Thanks. <laughs> right, right, Johnny, I'll give him a call. Here's Johnny! <laughs> oh, please, come on. Oh, no, no, come on, come on. They're not even real, they're fake. They're fake, I got you. <laughs> all right, all right, we, we get it, Johnny's hot. What was that? Nothing. Oh, oh no, 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 you, you, hey, you know you're my number one. The Halloween spirit. Oh. That was weird. Hey, 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 John. Whoa, hey, Mike. Wow. Um, now I will ask you both a series of trivia questions. The winner gets a piece of the Halloween spirit, and the loser dies. <laughs> that. Okay. All right. High stakes here. In the film Halloween, the mask Michael Myers wears is the face of a well-known actor covered in white paint. Which actor was it? A. Jack Nicholson, B. William Shatner, or C. Robert Redford? That is B, baby! Come on. 
Yeah, when you go into horror film university, that's like the first question on the quiz. All right, all right. Question number two. The Texas Chainsaw Massacre, Psycho, and Silence of the Lambs were all inspired by the actions of what infamous serial killer? A. John Wayne Gacy, B. Jeffrey Dahmer, or C. Ed Gein? That's a big old C for me. Boom. Come on. Question number three. How much screen time does Freddy Krueger get in the first Nightmare on Elm Street film? A, seven minutes, B, two minutes, or C, 13 minutes? Oh, wait, I don't remember the, the which one I wanted to do. Was, oh, this one, I think I wanted to do. Johnny, you die on that one, I'm sorry, it was too late. No, way too long. I didn't know. <laughs> no. Is it right? You are right, yes, okay. Okay. seven minutes. I will not die today. Question number four. Which room is Danny told to stay away from in The Shining? Is it A, room 119, B, room 453, or C, room 237? Correct, it is C, room 237. The other ones just don't have a ring to it. In Child's Play, what is Chucky's catchphrase? A, play with me. B, hi, I'm Chucky, your friend till the end. C, my name is Chucky, let's be friends. Yes, hi, I'm Chucky, your friend till the end. Question six. What are the three rules for Mogwise according to Gremlins? A, no water, no raw meat, no falling asleep. B, no bright lights, no water, no food after midnight. Or C, no darkness, no food, no alcohol. That's B. You guys are responsible for Mogwai. Great job. I should have known that was gonna be a Gremlins question. Question number seven. Which of the following killers has the most victims over the course of their movie careers? I know, which one. Is it A, Jason Voorhees, B, Freddy Krueger, or C, Michael Myers? <sighs> oh, you're both right! Ugh. I was legit nervous on that one. Question number eight. <laughs> How many days did it take to film Blair Witch Project? Was it A, 14 days, B, eight days, or C, three days? Oh, this, one, this one's hard. This is a little bit harder. Rob, you're both dead! It's eight days! What? <laughs> no! Oh, God. I think I'm still winning, but this is not good. Two more questions. <laughs> There's two more questions, okay. What is the highest grossing horror film of all time? Is it A, Halloween, B, Paranormal Activity, or C, It? <laughs> come on, baby, come on, Pennywise. You're right. Yes. You nailed it. Okay, good. All right. Question 10. What is the name of the high school in the film Carrie? Oh, well. Is it A, Bates High, B, Torrance High, or C, King High? Oh my god. Oh god. I think that's wrong. I think that's wrong. You're both wrong and you're both dead. No. <laughs> no. no. That is Death Gremlins 2 question. No. And Gremlins 2. What movie is Gizmo inspired by to kill all of the gremlins at the end? Rainbow. Yeah! Uh, Mike is the winner and gets the Halloween spirit. So that means but Johnny, that. you die. We'll let you live, Johnny, if Mike gives you the Halloween spirit and you run on foot to James and Chelsea. You are way closer. Okay, here you go. Okay, all right. You take the take it to James and Chelsea, but quick, hurry. Okay, I'll protect it with this cape. Great seeing you, Mike. Thank you. Good to see you too, buddy. I'm 
I got the goods. Johnny! Oh. I'm okay. I'm okay. Ah! Oh no! James! You got oh, the spear man. in your hands! Hey! Watch it, pal, or I'll come take a piece of you! Happy Halloween, everyone. I am so... James, what happened to your hands? Uh, I don't want to talk about it, man. Ryan, we need some help collecting more Halloween spirit. Do you think you can help us? I've got just the thing. That's it. Halloween's ruined. You're not going to be able to find enough Halloween spirit for the look-see. It's going to be over. No one's going to like you anymore. He's not going to want to talk to you anymore. It's going to be ruined. I thought even wearing this pumpkin shirt would be better, but I don't know what to do. I just, I need something to just poof, come into my life to give me that Halloween spirit. <sighs> Who did that? I survived Halloween 2020. I mean, it is cooler than this pumpkin shirt. Let's try it out. Huh. Whoa! Officially licensed! Alright. Come on, Ryan, think. What brings you Halloween spirit? Christmas trees! No. Snowmen? No. Think. Come on. What's that? I think it's time to get spooky. I got it. I'm here to have fear and by fear I mean fun. Everybody is a little bit spooky. Everybody is a little bit scary. Everybody freaky when they're not on the clock. We know you freaky. Don't act like you're not. Hey, uh, Skelly, how's it going? Yeah, I'm uh, just looking for some Halloween spirit. Do you know where I can find any? Really? Halloween candy. I like the way you think. Thanks, Kelly. For real though, there's a spooky skeleton inside of you. Everybody is a little bit spooky. Everybody is a little bit scary. Everybody freaky when they're not on the clock. We know you freaky. Don't act like you're not. Alright, Halloween spirit has to be in here somewhere. I guess I'll have to start. No. Nope. One down. A lot more to go. I can't find any Halloween spirit here. Say I'm here to have fear and by fear I mean fun. Everybody is a little bit spooky. Everybody is a little bit scary. Everybody freaky when they're not on the clock. We know you freaky. Don't act like you're not. <sighs> okay. So I couldn't find any Halloween spirit in the candy. But come on, pumpkin. You can't let me down. I know you got something in there. We just gotta open you up and find it for ourselves. Let's do this. Everybody is a little bit spooky. Everybody is a little bit scary. Gotta dress something, doesn't matter what you wear though. Put some hands out your clothes and now you are a scarecrow. No costume, here's what to do. Be a bed sheet goes and go boo to your boo. They don't like it? It's Halloween, boo hoo. Break up with them like what, boo hoo? Go get a marker, make sure that it's black. Draw the whiskers and nose and now you are a cat. Toilet paper, mummy, nothing wrong with that. All monsters are scary, and that is a fact. But why be scary with the costume on? I got it. I got the Halloween spirit. Look, see, here I come. Uh, hello? Is anyone there? Look, see, is, is that you? Oh, oh my god. Alright, guys, nice, funny, funny jokes there, but you almost made me drop this, okay? Here you go, Lexi. We're almost there! Well, what if, what if we... Yeah, I got nothing. 
I'm sorry guys, if I wasn't such a klutz, the Halloween spirit would be full by now. It's okay, James. You're a friend no matter what. You know, despite how crappy this year has been, I feel lucky to have such a great community of people all around me. Just every day, I wake up surrounded by the people and things that truly matter the most. So, you know, even if we don't have enough Halloween spirit, I'm not going to let that get me down. We should still celebrate the best time of the year! What's wrong, James? Uh, oh! Uh, let's see, catch! Yes! We did it! Yeah! It is I, Mr. TV, the true spirit Halloween. Thank you for reminding me. But where did it come from, Mr. Crypt TV? James, the Halloween spirit was inside of you all along. Huh. Now everybody dance! Listen up, boys and girls! <laughs> yeah, September's done. Now it's Halloween time, time, time. For a month, get spooky. I want to hear everyone. Say I'm here to have fear, and by fear I mean fun. Everybody is a little bit spooky. Everybody is a little bit scary. Everybody freaking when they're not on the clock. We know you freaky. Don't act like you're not. Everybody is a little bit spooky. Everybody is a little bit scary. Gotta dress a certain, doesn't matter what you wear though. Put some hay inside your clothes and now you are a scarecrow. No costume, here's what to do. Be a bed sheet, go single boo to your boo. They don't like it? It's Halloween, boo hoo. Wake up with them like that, boo hoo. Go get a marker, make sure that it's black. Draw the whiskers and nose and now you are a cat. Toilet paper, mummy, nothing wrong with that. All monsters are scary and that is a fact. But why be scary with a costume on? I'm scared of the world. There is so much wrong. Cause the scary was inside of you all along. For real though, there's a spooky skeleton inside of you. Everybody is a little bit spooky. Everybody is a little bit scary. Everybody freaky when they're not on the clock. We know you freaky. Don't act like you're not. <laughs> Thank you everyone for coming to Crypt TV's first ever digital Halloween. I hope you had as much fun as we did. And don't forget, even when the world seems scary, no one can take away the spooky spirit inside of you. Happy Halloween! Hey Crypt family. Hello Phoenix. Hello you little monsters. Hey guys. Hey guys. Amigos, amigos, it's me, Gigi Saul Guerrero. Hey everybody, I'm Mike Hickey. Here's James and Chelsea. Here's Johnny. Happy Halloween, everyone. Happy Halloween. And welcome to Crypt TV's Crypt TV. Crypt TV's Crypt TV. Crypt TV's, TV's digital Halloween. Don't act like you're not. <laughs> Subscribe for new scary videos and comment with your theories on the Crypt Monster Universe. Remember, it's all connected.